hi guys you welcome to my channel so this is what you are doing in this episode this episode six and today we are doing a detailed tutorial and we've introduced a new episode which is um how much we are going to sell what we are doing and then at the end of the video we introduce the next episode so these are the three basic things we'll be dealing with here so if you are new thank you so much for stopping by my channel if you are old yeah, so let's start work. with the first part which is the tutorial i'm using 0.25 bidding thread and i'm using size 8 mm pearls i'm using white pearls i cut about 200 centimeters of my thread of my 0.25 bidding thread and i folded it into two i just put the two ends together and i'm putting three of the pearls on it just like so mind you the thread is folded into two so i've not yet cut the other end and I'm using this silver stoppers here. I prefer using two, so I'm just going to put two of the stoppers on the thread. Just like so. One film, sorry. Yeah, and make sure you watch to the end because at the end of the video, we'll introduce the next episode so you get to know exactly what we'll be doing in the next episode. I'm using this locker here. That's what I'm going to use to lock my bracelet. So it's, it's in two parts. You can choose to open it and use one side or just put the two together on it. So I just put one part on the thread and I'm, I just let go of it and I'm going to put my thread back through the stoppers and the pearls just like so. Once that was done, I went ahead to press the stoppers very hard using my flat nose or flat mouth whichever way you call it make sure you press your stoppers very very hard so that your work doesn't come off once you cut off the SS thread so that was it and I just went ahead to get rid of the SS thread and yeah kindly subscribe turn on your bell notification so that you be notified the moment the next episode is uploaded we are still on the bidding series this is season 2 episode 6 so i went ahead to split open the other end of the thread and now i have two threads the left and the right thread so i went ahead to put two on the left two on the right so two pearls on the left thread then two pearls on the right thread just like so then I went ahead to cross thread with one. So with a cross threading, I put the bead on any of the threads. So in this case, you can put it on any of the threads. So in this case, I put it on the left thread. Then I went ahead to pass the right thread through it to the opposite direction. So the right thread will pass it through towards the left, just like so. Then I just pull my threads apart and this is what you should have for the first section if you are following carefully this is what you should have up to this point so to continue we are just going to do very 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 something simple so um two on the left two on the right then we cross thread with one that's basically what we are going to do now so we get to the length we want but at some point we'll introduce some seed bead just to make it more nicer more elegant so yeah just watch closely yeah and if you are new this is the beading series this is season two we've already dealt with season one we did 30 amazing um beaded slippers in season one and we are doing 30 extraordinary <laughs> amazing nice episodes or designs or styles of beaded bracelet so you don't lose anything by subscribing so just click on the subscription button and turn on your bell notification so that you be notified the moment the next episode is uploaded and the next episode will be introduced at the end of this very episode so make sure you watch to the end so that you know exactly what we'll be doing this way i introduced the seed bead so i went ahead to put one seed bead on the left and the right thread and I'm, i went ahead to cross thread with one pearl just like so so one seed bead on the left one seed bead on the right and i cross threaded with one pearl now i'm just going to put two pearls on the left two pearls on the right 
this seed bead part is optional you can choose to ignore it or choose to introduce a different type of bead it all depends on your creativity i prefer to use the seed bead so i just went ahead to cross thread just like we did earlier and this is what i have i'm just going to do the same thing i just did so introduce the seed bead then your tutu and cross threading just like we did earlier and i have two of what i did now now i want to put one seed bead on the left one seed bead on the right then i cross threaded with one pill just like so now to finish it up i measured and it was almost the same as the length i wanted so I put two on the left, two curls on the left, two curls on the right, and I put the two ends of the thread together and I put three of the pearls on it. So one, two, and the last one, three. So you know what? Next, we are just going to put our stoppers and then finish it up. So I went ahead to put two stoppers. When I use white, I prefer to use silver, and when I use gold or any other night, any other bright color, I prefer to use gold stoppers. So that's the other end of the locker. I just put my two threads through it, and then I pass it through the stoppers, just like we did earlier. So I'm passing it through the stoppers, then through the three pearls. Just like so make sure your work is very very tight so you pull, you try to pull your thread very very well but wisely so that you don't ruin your work and then I went ahead to press the stoppers very very well very hard I, I prefer using my two hands because I feel my one hand doesn't grip it very well so that's what we have here i guess go rid of this thread and guys this is what we have so up to this point if it's okay for you you are done you have your bracelet but if you want to make it more bougie like in you know we just move on to the next sorry about that we just move on to the next part or the part two of this very episode we are just going to pass a thread i single threaded my needle i'm passing the needle through the second seed bead and the third seed bead and i'm just trying to create a knot with the tail of the thread just like so you try to secure as many knots as you can that's basically what i'm trying to do now and try to pull your thread inward so that the knot will be secured in between the beads. Once that was done, I got rid of the excess thread. And now I have a thread with needle to work with. So I went ahead to pick one blue pearl. We are just going to put them in the holes. So I'm just going to pass my needle through the nest immediate middle bead the next immediate pearl then since there are seed beads there i pass my needle through the seed bead and to the next immediate pearl just like so i went ahead to pick the next blue seed bead just watch closely it's very very easy and very 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 simple so let it settle then you pass your needle through the next immediate pearl watch how i'm passing the thread through it just like so once that was done i went ahead to pass my thread through the seed bead and into the pearl again just like so i went ahead to pick the next pearl 
we are just trying to fill the the spaces so then through the next immediate middle pearl then once again we pass our thread or our needle through the seed bead so through a seed bead and a pearl one seed bead then the middle pearl Just watch closely. It's very, very, very easy. You can, you can try. You can do for a friend. You can do for anyone. Yeah, and yeah, guys. Just watch. This part is not difficult. That's why I've stopped explaining. So, since this is the first episode, we are introducing how much we are going to sell it. I want to give you the opportunity to tell me how much you think we should sell this in the comment section. So just tell me how much you think this thing should be sold in the comment section but in the next episodes we are going to analyze the materials you used how much each of them cost and then we all come to a conclusion how much we should sell it but today i want to give you the honest i want to do you the honest i want to give you the opportunity to tell me exactly how much you will sell this or you think we should sell this so once I was done, I just went ahead to create a couple of knots. And um, yeah, we are done. This is episode 6, guys. We are done. So I'm just creating knots, creating knots, creating knots. And this is this is very very easy, simple, but gorgeous. It can do with any color of beads of your choice. It all depends on your creativity, like I said earlier. So once I was done tying, I just got rid of the excess thread. And guys, I present to you episode six. This is what you are doing, episode six. So the next section is, you know what the next section is? How much do you think this thing should be sold? Is it 10 cities? Is it 15 cities? Is it 20 or is it 25 within that range? So let me know in the comment section how much you think this thing should be sold. And let's welcome episode 7. Yeah, guys, this is what you're doing episode 7. Thank you so much for watching up to this point. This is what you're doing the next episode. So make sure you do subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. And give this video a thumbs up. At least give, do it for the cute little girl over there. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in episode 7. Bye.